time for heaven on earth. The new heaven, the new Jerusalem, the conscious way to peace. To have the courage and the faith, which is the assured expectation of the things hoped for, the evident demonstration of realities not yet to be held that hope of healing, that hope of heaven on earth, that hope of peace, of joy, of love, the whole spirit anointed, the goodness, the kindness, the mildness, gentleness, patience, self-control. Not to sin or hurt or abuse another, not to coercively control others for the peace for the trust and so may justice be upheld for peace and safety for the trust so we have the courage and the faith to seek our peace and happiness We have to wrestle between what's right and wrong. What was the cause of that pain? Make it conscious. Process it, grieve it. God will wipe away our tears. And blessed are those who mourn for they will be comforted. We need to mourn those hurts and pains and griefs. We have to forgive where it's become negative, <clears throat> where it was hurtful. Because there will be a pain somewhere that it's come from, or a lack of love where it's come from, or a fear. Forgive forgiving love to another we have to hear we have to hear what that reason was what that pain is what that pain is saying what it's asking for for release we have to adhere to the process of love and be kind and patient and self-control not to allow that destructive force to take hold for the peace for that reconciliation for that revival of the spirit of the energy of light the consciousness the understanding that it will process, it will release, it will go. It's no good locking hurts and pains inside or drinking them away, numbing the pain or taking the drugs. Sometimes medications are needed. We've all been helped by them, I'm sure I have. But ultimately we need to cultivate the love. The kindness, the care, the gentleness, the mildness, the goodness, the moral and righteous way for justice to be upheld for peace and safety. We have to adhere to the process of love in order for then our body, which is the temple, to be able to release our natural endorphins. 
to change from the sympathetic nervous system of fear. Back to the parasympathetic nervous system, where our body knows how to look after itself, how to love and care, and the energy of life, the life energy. The Bible talks about sin causing death. It's death of the spirit, of peace, of life, of love. Because it changes to fear, which is our get out of danger mechanism, which has to be um, it, it has to be um, <laughs> active in order to keep us safe, so it's stronger. And we have to consciously work towards the love because the love is conscious. Consciousness. And that's where we find the peace. In every language and tongue. In every body. Because love is not a cortisol stress hormone in anybody. Because that's fear. And then we have to be tolerant of others on this journey. It is the quest for life that we're all on in one way or another. And there has to be trust. And trust can only come from the law being upheld for peace and safety, peace and security, trust for that positive for faith for the ultimate positive psychology to know that we can create and look after and nurture heaven on earth because look look at what we have why do we want to turn it into concrete prisons why do we want to take this away from children? The freedom of caring for nature. The freedom. The peace. And that's the truth. And only the truth will set us free. We must have the faith and we must have grace. We must have thanks, gratitude for the beauty that's beyond man-made. The beauty of our planet Earth. Which is a haven for life. And our seas too. And that life coexists together in a conscious caring world providing for each other, looking after each other. We have to recognize and acknowledge how it does that. And there's thousands of years of teachings of knowing how we can look after these things, how we can garden organically and grow. And compost for new soil, for new life, for herbs and flowers and foods, and trees for, for birds to nest and sing, bring forth their chicks from eggs to wing for new life, new beginnings, 
self-producing, self-sustainable. Trees of life need to be ripe for goodness and abundance of life. And for healing. So many drugs are based on the healing properties of plants. If it's manufactured, it's man-made and can be owned and made money from. But the love of money is the, the root to the evil, to all evil. And we can see that in our world in these last days before the return of the light. And the light is returning. And we are all one. We are male and female. We have male and female aspects to our whole body, the spirit. And it's not a competition. The name for one is different in different languages, but in essence, oneness is the same. In spirit, oneness. Where we don't need to fight and blame one another and own, try and own, coercively control. It's time to end all abuse for the peace and heaven here on earth as promised for the promised land to come. Come. I love anointed. The most high name. Jesus Christ in English. Yeshua HaMashiach in Hebrew. Isa in Arabic. Christos in Greek. I've been learning about Shiva and Shanti this week. Masculine and feminine aspects of spirit and life and the peace the chakras of our body are the light coming from our endocrine system or not the light of attaining to the endorphins the anandamide the bliss the bliss molecule the bliss they call bliss chance and chance for joy so beautiful so peaceful And I see from those chants that Anana and the name Anandamide comes from the Sanskrit for bliss. And we're all one. We're all made whole and one. In that positive spirit for life.
but we need to attain it in our body, in each and every one of us. And that being still, knowing God, and allowing that processing of the feelings that arise and pass on this journey of sharing and caring and loving one another in life, everyone. And when we have that light, that's when we become hu human. Humans being love, being light, enlightened for love, to be able to love one another. It's time to end all wars and the holy city, Zion, the new heaven on earth, as promised for the promised land to come. God has a promise. God wins. God's one. God is wonderful. And we are one. With love. Only with love. For the peace. For peace in heaven here on earth. Hallelujah. God bless, love bless, love bless us with the light of enlightenment. For love to prevail. For peace. Om Shanti, Om Shanti, Om Shanti.